I'm Jim Beckman. I'm from Denver, Colorado. I'm a faculty member at the Augustine Institute and uh, I work with the lay division of formation for the seminary at the Archdiocese of Denver. If I was to talk about the seed uh, and those kind of initial stages of discipleship, uh, I, I think that there's these, these critical, I, I call them hinging realities, these uh, um, activities that are a, a part, you know, a really critical part of this early stage of growth. One is relationship. We, we've got to be in relationship with God, obviously, and really accessing that relationship in prayer. But we've got to be in relationship with other people. It's really hard to grow as an early stage disciple without having the support and, uh, and, and brotherhood, community, fellowship of, of other people. Um, but then we also need content. Uh, so re relationship and that second hinging reality is, is the content of the faith. We, we have to be growing in a greater knowledge and a greater understanding. Uh, the, the general directory for catechesis talks about the stage in, 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 in a way where it, it calls an initiatory catechesis. And w one of the things that it talks about is that it needs to be comprehensive and systematic, but it, but it needs to be basic instruction. In, in Christian living, uh, and, and, I, and I think that's, uh, it's just so important that people are getting that kind of content early on. But, but the third hinging reality, which I, I think is missing in a lot of ways, I, I, I see this in lots of places in the church, is mentoring. Uh, so somebody needs to have the faith modeled for them, and, and, and that's what really helps them get traction and growing. When they can see somebody else doing it, then it, it makes it easier for them to uh, to kind of take it, take it on for themselves. So th those kind of three hinging realities, be in relationship, find content, access to content of the faith, and study it, learn it, and grow in your knowledge of it. But then third, look for a mentor. Look for somebody who can model uh, how to take that basic instruction of the Christian life and help you put it into practice. Uh, if, if you do those three things and you're, you're really desiring to grow, you're going to get traction and you're going to start growing as a disciple.